Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I have a super, super exciting video. Um, I am showing you my entire Kylie holiday collection bundle I bought. I'm doing a demo with some of the products that I have on my face right now, this makeup look, and I'm also showing you swatches of every single thing in the collection, except for the blush, and you'll find that out later. <laughs> but um, yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. I really hope you enjoy, enjoy. so let's get into the video. Alright, so starting the demo portion, I already have my foundation done in my concealer because it didn't come with it obviously, so I just, you know, did that, got that out of the way. And now I'm going to try the perfecting powder, which I'm actually really excited about because with all the reviews and stuff I saw, apparently it's supposed to like really blur your pores, so we'll have to just see. I don't know why people don't like the packaging too, like... I don't know. I think the packaging is so cute. I love the like baby blue color, but that just happens to be like one of my favorite colors anyway. So before I put it on too, I'm just going to put a headband on because I'm one of those people who cannot do their makeup if their hair's in their way. It's just so annoying. Cool. So now I'm just going to take the perfecting powder and just going to put it all over my face and see what it does. First, make sure there's no creases. This is what it looks like. Oh my God. I wish you guys could see this. I literally look so good. I did not think this was gonna be that good, to be honest. <laughs> I'm just gonna apply it like literally everywhere. Okay guys, like this powder is literally magic. I have zero pores on my face. Let me see if I could zoom in really close to show you guys. I don't know if you guys could see that, but oh my god. My skin looks so good. Okay, now next step would be blush, but unfortunately they gave me two highlighters instead of the highlighter and the blush because I got the whole entire bundle. So I'm waiting for that to come in the mail, but I can let you know how I like it down below. Which is really disappointing because I was excited to try it, but I'll just put some blush on real quick and I'll be right back. Okay, so I'm back, and if you're curious to what I used for my bronzer and blush, I used Melba by MAC, and then I used my Park Ave Princess bronzing palette, and I used the shade Princess Cut, which is very taupe and more gray-toned. So next I'm going into the highlighter, which I'm so excited for because I heard this was so good too. I heard if there was like one thing you should get out of this whole collection, it would be the highlighter. So let's see how it performs. I'm going to just take this brush. This is a Beach Cosmetics brush. It's just like a fat, fluffy one. And um, we're going to go into this. Okay, yeah, this is, this is pretty poppin'. This is pretty intense. <laughs> I just burped. <laughs> I'm such a mess. Okay, so I pretty much applied it everywhere and yep, this highlighter is <laughs> intense. Um, if you like an intense highlighter, you're gonna love this. I mean, so I love it. I really like a very blinding highlight so wow this is gorgeous let me see if I could show you guys like how intense it is hold on okay so now going into the palette one thing that I should point out is when I received the palette all of the eyeshadows were like popped out I'm not sure why so I had to like pop them back in with my finger like luckily nothing is broken 
So, I mean, I'm fine with it, but just a little warning. Maybe it was just a rocky ride to where I live. <laughs> so, I'm just going to start and do a quick little eye look. I'm going to first take Cuddle Season, and I'm going to just run it through my crease. So far, so good. I like the pigmentation. I think it's very buildable so far with just the transition shade. I feel like once I keep applying it, it shows up even more and more, which I really like. Um, sometimes uh, eyeshadows are super hard to blend, so I kind of like something that's going to like go on in like a single layer and then you could build it up even darker because that just means it's easier to blend. For the next shade, I'm going to take Just Chill, which is like a really pretty purple shade. And I'm just going to run that through my crease too. Next I'm going to take the shade Mrs. Claus and I'm going to put it all over my lid. So first I'm going to start off with a flat shader brush and then if that doesn't work I'm just going to use my finger. So yeah, definitely more payoff with the finger, but that's like the same thing. Like that happens with all palettes really, but it is a very beautiful shade. So now that that color is on my lid, I'm just going to take Jingle Baby, which is a really pretty light sparkly pink. And I'm just going to put that in my inner corner. Oh my god, that's so pretty. I really love the light baby pink shade. It's gorgeous. Now taking the two shades I used in my transition, I'm just going to put that underneath my lash line to finish off the look. I mean, so far, everything blended out really beautifully. I mean, obviously, I didn't use every single shade in the palette, so I can't really tell you what I think about them. But so far, so good. I really like the eyeshadows. So next off camera, I'm going to do my eyeliner and my mascara and my eyebrows, and I will be right back. All right, so the very last step is the lips. So I think I'm just going to use the one lip kit that comes in the set, and this one is in the shade Kissmas. It's a really pretty nude, but um, a lot of people like this as well, so I figured let's try it out, see if it's worth it. Oh, that's perfect. It matches my shirt, like, exactly. <laughs> so I'm just going to line my lips with the lip liner first. Okay, so now once it's on, it doesn't match my outfit at all, but that's okay. Um, and here's the liquid lipstick. Wow, this is a beautiful shade and definitely something I would wear too. Oh wow, I really like that. I'm just going to take it off and I'm going to try something else because I thought this would match my outfit more. But right, you know what I really wanted to try? The metallic lipsticks. So I think I'm going to use Snow Cute because the name is just... It's Snow Cute. <laughs> oh my god, that's so pretty. I'm one of those like rare people who really like metallic shades because I just love the look of something super glossy. season, cold hearted, pray for snow, home alone, jingle baby, wrap it up, and right before Xmas is the green. For the next row we have Just Chill, Mrs. Claus, Make Magic, Bundle up, plum pudding, spirit, and hello winter, snowflake. Next for the metallic.
metallic lipsticks, we have Stay Cozy, Burr, Cold as Ice, and Snow Cute. Then we have Milk and Cookies, which is this then really we have Snow Sparkle, which is this white. Then for the loose highlighters, we have Mary Bright, and above it is Let It Glow. Okay, well, this is the final look, and I do have to say, so far, for everything I used, I really do like absolutely everything that I've tried in this video. That's not saying that I'm going to try all this out and I'm going to like absolutely everything. That's not what I'm saying, um, but I can try everything out and definitely let you guys know down below my initial thoughts on everything. I do know that her darker liquid lipsticks, you do have to build them up like twice, at least for what I find for me personally. And also, it is a bit of a disappointment that I didn't get the blush, but they were very nice about it and they are going to ship me out one for free, so that's very nice of them. Um, yeah, I do have to say though, there's like a lot of metallic products, like lip products and stuff, like, so if you don't like metallic lip stuff, you probably won't like this. Um, and I know there's like a lot of controversy around Kylie Cosmetics and her makeup line and how people think it's not worth it and stuff like that. I personally really do like her makeup. I think it's comparable to high-end makeup and it's all personal preference to be honest. So I definitely will let you know down below, but um, yeah, so that concludes this video. Thank you guys so much for watching and definitely don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and subscribe down below. That would help me out so much and I love you all and I will see you in the next video. Bye guys!